Jeremiah in this book is incredibly bold with God. He just calls God out. And he says, God, I don't like what's going on in my life. I'm tired of this, enough's enough, I need a change. Come on, you're treating me poorly. And he complains, he does a Jeremiah, that's what we get from this, this book. And he lets out his anger to God in its full fury. Let me just read a few verses. In uh, Lamentations 3, 1 to 10, he says this. I am a man who has seen affliction by the rod of his wrath. He's talking about God. He, God, has driven me away and made me walk in darkness rather than in light. He, God, has turned his hand against me again and again and again all day long. He has made my skin grow and broken my bones, grow old and broken my bones. He surrounded me with bitterness and hardship. He's made me dwell in dark places, in darkness like the dead. He says, God has walled me in so I cannot escape. He says, there's no way out. He says, he's weighed me down with chains. Even when I cry out to God for help, he shuts out my prayer. He has barred my way with blocks of stone. He's made my paths crooked. Now, that's in the Bible. Does that surprise you? Somebody's calling out God in the Bible? And, and really, he's just getting started. He does it for five chapters. <laughs> he is just really complaining to God. And he's saying, God, this stinks. Now, why in the world would God put that kind of passage in the Bible? I'll tell you why. Because what God wants you to know, he can handle your anger. He can handle your frustration. He can handle your gripes and your grief. Actually, this entire book is one long complaint. That's why they call it lamentation. And he, God, is allowing Jeremiah to blow off steam. Now, you've heard me say this many, many times. That if I don't talk out my emotions to God, I will take them out on my body. When I swallow my anger, my stomach keeps score. When I swallow my emotions, my frustration, I take it out on my body. So, oh man, it's a pain in the rear. <laughs> well, how do you think it got here? You swallowed it and it went south. <laughs> okay? It stopped at your neck. Some of you, your, the pain stopped in your neck. Some of it went a little bit lower, lower and it went in your back. But when you swallow your negative emotions, it, you take it out on your body. God says, it's okay, I can handle this. I can handle it. Go ahead and just tell me how you're feeling. Give me all your complaints. It's not fair what's going on right now. God, I don't like this in my life. It's okay to tell God that you're ticked off. 